Welcome to my YouTube automotive channel. In today's video I will show you how to remove the upper grill from 2008 Chevy Impala. Uh, this applies to Chevy Impalas made from 2006 all the way up to 2016. So I will be moving this grill and installing it onto this blue Impala right here. I will try to record this video as fast as possible because it's quite cold outside. So yeah, I hope it won't take me too long. Okay, first you will want to pop out uh, four of these plastic trim screws. So this one here, this one here, and two on this side, this one and this one. Now only these two are actually holding this uh, upper small grill but by removing this two on the side you'll get more space to work okay so these things can be a real pain to remove sometimes so what you want to do first try to pry it with uh, something like this or a flat screwdriver underneath from each side so you can get uh, this middle pin out once you have it a bit out then it's the best chance to get the pliers and try to grab it and just slowly wiggle it out okay see now you can proceed to remove the other other guys okay now once you have those top screws out all this is nice and loose now what I like to do, I like to remove this uh, chrome piece first and then remove the, the top grill just because it's gonna be easier to, to access it. They're both held by lots of uh, small plastic clips so you have to be careful when you are removing this. So I will show you now how to do it. Okay, so what you want to do pretty much, you just want to pry between this chrome piece and the grill itself. There is no screws, just these plastic clips. So you want to go all around until all of these pop out. See? Nice and easy. Okay, I will try to do it from the other side. Okay, I have the other side out. You see, those are the clips down there. Okay. Okay, and this is the piece, so you can see a bunch of, bunch of clips up on the top part and the bottom part. And now, once you have removed this chrome part, it's gonna be much easier to remove the grill itself okay so you pretty much want to try and pull it straight out if you can't pull it by hand try to again use the flat screwdriver or something okay, i have this side out so you can see how they look it's a bunch of small plastic clips then you can just go and keep pulling it so you can see here i have a couple of them out there at the bottom now we try going a bit from this side as well Just take your time with this so you don't break any of them, you see. I got two out at the bottom and I just have um, one, two, three of them left at the bottom and that's it. Okay, so I'll maybe try prying it underneath here. You just have to play with it. Okay, just have one more left I think. I actually hate these plastic clips, they are a nightmare. Okay, just one left. Okay, I'll have to use both of my hands to get it out, I guess. 
Okay, that's it pretty much. So I think you got the idea what you have to do to remove this upper grill. Maybe I didn't do it the best, but I didn't break any of the clips, so I guess um, I did something good. So once again, I will show you all the clips you have to remove. So you have a couple of them at the bottom. See? And a couple of them at the top. Actually, two at the top. One is here, and one is here, and two on the side. And these crumpies, I guess you don't have to remove it without this. You can remove all in one piece. But on the other impeller I was doing, I just found it easier first to remove the chrome part because it's much more sensitive so I don't crack it or break it and then removing the, the plastic trim. Okay, thank you for watching this video, I hope it was helpful. If it was, please like it and subscribe to my YouTube automotive channel. On my channel you can find lots of how-to videos, do-it-yourself videos, car reviews, product reviews and other similar automotive topics.